Say hi, everyone. Oh, sweet. I'm here with Lisa Fair, and we're at the monastery. We've been here for a couple of weeks, just in prayer and quiet, uh, very nurturing inward time for both of us. And we are going to be on the holding the online retreat coming up next weekend. And the theme of it is limitless and free, an mm. uncompromising life. So we're just inspired to to join with you now and share what's on our heart mm. and invite you into this experience with us next mm. weekend. Beautiful. Yeah, I feel like the, the thought and the word that's coming to me is enthusiastic, feeling this in enthusiasm mm. to be able to extend this love and this light and this gratitude together with all of us coming together with the same goal yeah it just feels like an honor mm. yeah yeah we've really been nurturing our own relationship with God I mean that's what the whole journey is about and removing the obstacles to the awareness of that of that presence and that state of mind oh, and and so that's really all we have to offer is our experience of of this and and just our own experience like it's mm -hmm. all you know I'm not going to be talking about anything I haven't experienced mm -hmm. It's always about a direct experience. It's really not about the teaching. We want to feel the presence of love and that limitlessness. And we were talking it has nothing to do with the human condition. Mm -hmm. It's really a state of mind, of freedom. And this, uh, you were sharing a quote about the limitless gentleness or whatever. Mm -hmm. I don't know, maybe you want to share that. Yeah, the never <clears throat> underestimate the limitless of gentleness mm. yeah, and that's mm. what it feels like we're in this really gentle place mm. right now that feels just so it's the greatest gift mm. you know to be in such presence to be in the gentleness and this mm. love and nurturing this this gift and and I guess even for our relationship I don't know if we've said it but you know we've been together like um, 12 13 years and mm -hmm. just have had a lot of opportunities to practice forgiveness and mm -hmm. mirroring and you know just really this willingness to keep coming back together and and bringing the darkness to the light and giving it to the holy spirit and yeah just like a a real lifetime mm -hmm. basically of practicing forgiveness together yeah 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 and then it's like a, a a brother who's devoted is worthy of devotion, is a mm. quote from the Course, and that's what I feel because mm. of our relationship. Like when there's a deep devotion and commitment to forgiveness, mm. then you acknowledge the devotion in your brother mm. because we experience that. We really know that in one another. Mm. And it's a holy, it's a holy awareness mm. that then reinforces it for myself. You know, if I see your devotion, and I know you're devoted, it's like reinforcing devotion in my own mind, reminding mm. myself of my commitment, my devotion, mm. and, and not to question it, you know, not to question it. The ego's always questioning and doubting and undermining, you know, the truth of who we are. And that's what we come together for, is to support each other. And it's it's the commitment to keep, you know, mm. okay, you know, just whatever's going on. It's like there's this commitment through this whole thing. And that's really, I feel like we've been in this assignment with David for many, many years. And just his commitment and his devotion. And really learning how to forgive. Mm. And really seeing just what this takes to really face the ego and and uh, look at the obstacles and taking responsibility in our own minds and the level of honesty that it takes and transparency and safety mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know I don't know if we said that on this video but no. like just the safety like the trust that's imperative for the mind to be able to open up mm -hmm. yeah yeah it's essential like in a when you're afraid like you can't let love in and, and you can't 
admit really even what's happening because you're mm. too afraid to even see it and look upon it. Whereas when there's a safety and a trust and a welcome, you know, then it, it naturally arises mm. like perfect love. It, it almost draws fear out. Like <laughs> mm. it, it brings to the surface what's ready to be, what we're ready to, to face and be released from. Right, and it's not pretty. So it's like, you know, being able to allow that, mm -hmm. whatever needs to come up and that commitment to forgive and mm. to see really it's our own thoughts that we're forgiving, our own beliefs. Yeah. It's not somebody else. Yeah. It's really just what's going on in our own mind together. So, mm -hmm. so yeah, so we'll be together this weekend. <laughs> And uh, yeah, and then you're going to Europe. Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure where I'm going. I'm kind of the mystery girl. Not sure where I'm going, but I know that we'll be together this weekend, mm. Friday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we hope to see you there. And there's going to be a link, I think, with this video mm -hmm. and instructions. And there's support if you haven't ever been part of one of our online retreats. We'd love to see you. You know, there's support to be able to like walk through the steps and. Yeah, and they're very intimate. Um, those who've been on them before don't know this. It's like a, a global family. Um, oh, thanks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like a global family. And there's a group um, who come consistently every month to join together for the whole weekend. And then if you've never been before, um, then we just like welcome you mm. fully with all of our heart. It's very intimate. It's mm. like you have everyone up close with their with their laptop and their camera and just really, really together. It feels like we're all in the same room, even closer than live in a big room because mm. we're so close up with the cameras mm. um, and they're interactive. There's an opportunity to really bring your prayer. In fact, your prayers and your questions are like the foundation underneath the retreat. You know, we go through whatever you write in as your question beforehand and pray about it and and that really helps us um, open up to the spirit coming through so, to answer mm. the prayer mm. for healing. Beautiful. So. Okay, well, I thought maybe I could even show you just a little, like give them a little look of where we're at here. Oh, it's so yeah. gorgeous just to turn the camera around. And over there's Jason. He's like, he'll be showing the movie on Saturday. So just this beautiful, beautiful backdrop that we've been in here. Hmm. Okay. We're so blessed. Thank you. Thank you. Lots of love. Bye-bye.